Welcome to the first episode of WSC for Dummies. In this series, we will tell you more about the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge and how it works. I am Rob, and I'll be telling you more about our convoy and how it works during the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge. The function of the convoy is to support the solar car. In total, there are 11 cars during the race, the solar car included. The race convoy consists of three cars that may never lose each other. The DMU, Ready, and the Escort. You can see the DMU behind me. This car is the car that drives behind the solar car. In this car, the decisions of the strategists are made. The main communication with the driver is via the DMU. The DMU is, apart from the solar car, the most important car of the convoy. The car that drives directly in front of the solar car is the Escort. The Escort guides the solar car through the outback and has all the communication with the rest of the convoy and, all, and other cars on the road. But what about the other cars in the convoy? In this picture you can see all cars in a row. There are three media cars that house our media crew. These people make sure that you can experience the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge at home. The weather car checks the weather conditions one hour in front of Ready. The Eagle prepares control stops and the Scout communicates all oncoming traffic. We hope the people on the surface won't be that busy and can sleep all day because they are there to fix Ready on the road if necessary. Last but not least, the truck crosses the Outback too. The truck transports all our camping gear. Besides our 19 team members, there are many other people to support us during the race. There are three truck drivers, a media crew and a few former team members that drive with us too. These people bring the needed experience about the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge to make the race a success. In total our team from Twente consists of 39 people during the race. Thanks for watching this first WSC for Dummies. Next Monday we are here for you too, with a new item about a driver and the way your Scholar car ready is controlled during the race. So stay tuned and see you next week.